some interesting topics here. Let's go. So moms are so burned out, apparently, that some of them fantasize about being hospitalized. What? Actually hospitalized. What? Let me explain. Yeah, this is according to a senior editor at Scary Mommy who wrote this article with many moms agreeing with her dark secret. She says being forced to stay in bed, getting three cooked meals delivered each day, and only seeing her kids during visiting hours while people take care of them for a change would be really nice. She says this should be a wake-up call to partners and families, to the government, to the community, that moms are not getting nearly enough support and care for, uh, from mothers, right? So she finishes by saying that if moms have to suffer basically a medical emergency just to have a cooked meal for them or to take a nap, or to experience some peace, there's something very bad going on in our culture mm. and society, and something basically needs to change. Um, what do you think about I, that? I was just gonna say, I, know, I, I was hospitalized, a, and you're a mom, so let's yeah. talk about mom, that. Uh, I will say I do not agree with that article. I, I mean, the last thing in the world I would want is to ever even put myself in a situation where I'm playing a role of like having a medical emergency. I agree, I think that's a little extreme. I just, God forbid, like God health forbid is, is right. no joke, you know? Like that's not even funny. Also like I don't really like people doing things for me. I like to do things myself. The idea of being like stay put, you can't move, you can't do anything, that would drive me nuts. Mm. I don't wanna do that. Like I wanna be out and about and doing yeah. things. So <laughs> that's just me though. I, people should know this about you and I have noticed it even more over the last year. You are the best multitasker I have ever seen. Thank I will you. go into your office and we have our morning coffee and you will be, the coffee's going, the steamer's going, you've got your hair, the heat, curling iron's being heated up, the patches are under the, you know, every, you're like doing five things at once. Yeah. And there's music, classical music playing, there's a package, the kids you're texting with, you know. It, you yeah, no, I can't, I don't know how to relax, which isn't good, I mean, it's not good. Mm -hmm. I, I can't relax, it's like physically impossible for me to, so. Yeah. Uh, you know, I guess it's a good thing and a bad thing. But You've made me want to up my game. Oh, wow. Well, then. <laughs> Look at you know. inspiring wow. people. Hashtag Aroxia energy. Yeah. Oh, thanks. But as somebody who was on the other end of this hospitalized, yeah. I can't imagine saying, like, be careful saying things like that because you don't want to be hospitalized. You don't yeah. want to be chained to a hospital bed for mm -hmm. days or weeks upon end. It's like careful the things you say, right? Yeah, careful yeah. the things you say.